Hello, everyone. Headed home from the dealership. Just uh, picked up a toy for my wife, Tracy. So, if you've been watching my videos, you know I'm looking for a TW200. And that, that's a little Yamaha dual sport. Real little thing. Big, big fat tires on it. I'm looking to buy that. So like when I go to St. Joe or go ATV trip, that I have that and it's street legal. So I can drive it, you know, to town or whatever. Because a lot of times it'll be just the RV and then the trailer. So I, I'm buying it, but there's none at the dealership. So I'm looking for a used one. And I was trying to figure out what I'm gonna get Tracy. So she didn't want a TW 200. She did her motorcycle test on a TW 200, her class in Illinois, and she didn't want one. And that was actually her first motorcycle was a TW 200. So I was thinking of a Grom, which is Honda, or the, the Kawasaki, the Grom Killer, whatever they call it. It's, it's a Z125, which kind of looks like a Grom. And she didn't like that. So then the Honda has one that looks like a mini bike kind of thing. It's called the Monkey. It's a retro. She didn't like that. So she said she wants more of a scooter. So I remembered that Honda makes a scooter now. You know, kind of like a Vespa, but it's different. And it's called a Super Cup, a 125 Super Cup. Getting past, I'm doing 57. I guess 57 is too slow. Speed limit's 55. Anyway, so I've been looking for those. They had one at McGrath, so I got there this morning when I took my boo to get her anal glands extracted because they were they wouldn't do their thing at the the groomer, so they said I had to, to have a vet do it. So I did. So I stopped there, and they'd already sold it this morning. So I couldn't buy that one. They said it'd probably be the end of the year or next year before they get another one because of this COVID stuff. So I was online, and there was a guy that bought one in Vinton, Iowa. Had 30, what is it? 37 miles on it. So he just bought it with one mile and uh, three months ago, and it has 37 miles, and I got it for what he paid for it. So... Actually, 300 less from what the paperwork. He paid 36 something. I paid 33. So I guess I did okay. Don't know. I think that's what he said. I don't remember. Anyway, actually, that's what McGrath told me they'd sell it to me for 37. The one they had that they just sold. So that's where I got that number from. So he sold it to me for 33. He wanted more, but I offered 33 and he took it. So. I think that's how it works. So, just headed home now. I'm going to take it out. I'll take a little video of it when I get home. Oh, it's funny. i got to say this. So, I have this trailer, the orange and black trailer that I know you've seen in my videos. And the first thing I do is I pull up to pick it up after, you know, I drove my motorcycle to go buy it just to look at it. So, I had to come back with the trailer. And the first thing, he walks out and he said, do you want to sell your trailer? Because they're in short, short short supply right now high demand supply and demand so all right i'm going to end this here and then i'll post a new video when i get home and unload it oh and then i'll probably take it for a little spin see ya all right just got home let's see you won't believe this so i gotta show you there's key fobs there's no key it's key fobs for this thing Okay. There it is. Takes up no space in there, that's for sure. Okay. That didn't move. That's a good thing. 
Here she is. <laughs> oh, it's funny looking. It's actually kind of pretty though. All right. Gonna get it out of here. Take it for a spin. Okay, got it running. Here. Vroom, vroom. So, I don't know if you can see that. No, probably not. It's on E. Got a gear selector, 37 miles. Tells you the time. Here's the RP. Eh, it goes up to 80. <laughs> I don't think so. I'm going to take it up to uh, the gas station and get some gas in it. Go for a spin. <laughs> it alarms. When you walk away from it, it alarms with the key fob. So it's really weird. All you do to you get close to it, you press this little button. Press the button. Beeps, hear it. Then you turn it. I'm sniffling. Then you start it. And the go. So it's got this weird shifter. So you can, it's in neutral, you press down on this to go, which I didn't like very much, so I just clicked up like a normal motorcycle. Huh. I only got it to 45. I'm sniffling, and it took a whole half gallon of gas. It only holds a gallon. But, <laughs> it was actually kind of fun. Let's see it beep. It's going to beep. There it goes, it beeped. Yeah, it was kind of fun. I was really surprised. I mean, I'm a big guy. But it felt fine. So it would be perfect for Tracy. But I... I mean, 45, 50, I think that's probably the max, which is perfect for what we'll be using it for. Yeah, that, that was wild. So I guess I better put it away, and I told Tracy to go in the, the shop and look tonight, so when she gets home, she'll see your new toy. So I brought it inside, just sitting here so she can see it when she comes home. I'm not sure what any of this is. This is the gas fill, it's under the seat. And it's electronic too, so you press this little button right there and it unlocks it, you lift that and put fuel in it. I don't know what, I don't know what that is. Okay, huh, that little button opened this. Huh. Little tool, tool thing. Huh, okay, that's interesting. I got the sniffles. I didn't take my allergy pill today. That's what's wrong. I have to find out where the battery is. Because I need a... I don't see... What's this? Oh, it's just a handhold. Oh, okay. Oh, because there's no... Uh, there's no kickstand. It's the center stand. So I guess that's so you can pull up. Oh, that's a good idea. Okay, so I'll have to figure out where the battery is. And put in... I don't know what any of this is. So I can put a battery tender because I keep all my motorcycles on the battery tenders over there. Best, I love these things. Here, I'll show you. It's those. See, it's got four banks. And then I got over there four banks on that one. Works great. Awesome. Well, I hope she likes it. She needs the basket though. I wonder if they sell it. I'll have to find a basket. Probably order from Taiwan or something. Well, that's it. I'm done. I'm done for the day. It's been a busy day taking the dog to the vet and everything. So, adios, amigos.